Hi everyone, welcome to the Forward Trust Enterprise Support Service. My name's Stephen Anderson and I'm the Enterprise Coach for the Forward Trust, supporting and focusing on our clients who are considering going into self-employment or starting up their own business. This is a part of our contribution to Global Entrepreneur Week. We are here talking about our mentoring support service and I have with me one of our star mentors, Kelly. I'm going to ask Kelly a couple of questions that will give you, the audience, some context to our enterprise mentoring support service. Kelly, give us a short snapshot of your, your life journey, just a little, give so the audience can give a bit of who is Kelly. So I moved to London from the countryside at the age of 18, where I began my working life as a secretary. I did various tenting jobs before landing a position with the deputy editor of a magazine, where I stayed for just over a year. I then decided and had the opportunity to move to Paris, France. The decision to move to London and then to Paris were pivotal and really shaped me and broadened my whole outlook. Paris was an exciting city. I loved it. I was taken on by IBM Europe as a secretary and then progressed into the personnel department as an administrator. I learned to speak French and was very involved with the whole French way of life, only returning to the UK once a year. IBM was really formative for me in terms of what was expected from an employee. It gave me a really good grounding in working life. It was also during my time in Paris that I became very interested in photography and art. But after six years, I returned to London. On returning to London, I then returned to secretarial work and joined an advertising agency, which eventually led to my becoming the PA and art buyer to the chairman and creative director of a small agency. The art buying side exposed me to meeting lots of photographic and illustrative agents. I would view the portfolios and the ones I thought were good, I would show to my boss. I also learned to organize photographic shoots and, be and began to cast for these as well. I eventually applied for a, a job at a small photographic agency specializing in fashion photography. It was very cutting edge at the time and I became a photographic agent. This move changed my life completely. I learned so much working for a young dynamic team. I worked for this agency for five years before leaving to join another agency which specialised more in mainstream advertising photographers, which really helped to broaden my knowledge of photography and advertising. Finally, I was approached by a rising fashion photographer who I'd previously represented, who asked me when I was going to be his agent again. And I asked him to give me six months, during which time I contacted my would-be business partner, and we then set up our agency, specialising in fashion photography and stylists. We ran a small, successful and profitable business for 20 years, employing around seven people with an annual turnover of just over £3 million pounds a year. In 2007, we purchased an office in Shoreditch and we converted it into two spaces, one of which we used as an office and the other used as a studio. This proved to be extremely successful. And then in 2015, we decided to wind down the company. The industry had changed really beyond recognition. And I think both of us had actually been in the business for over 25 years by that time. And so it was just a sort of a natural kind of end. We completely separated. We actually, we owned the roof to our office we then developed it into a luxury apartment, which we then sold. So now we still retain our offices, which we rent out. So how did you get involved with us at the beginning? Well, I was very interested in doing volunteer work and particularly for the charitable sector. And I approached a great friend of mine, Sir Adrian Fulford, who was Justice of Appeal at the time. And he introduced me to Isabel Laurent, who is, I think, one of your trustees. And she introduced me to you guys. <laughs> so I sent her my CV and she thought I would be good for the entre entrepreneurial side.
and the impact on yourself how have you found the mentoring process oh i find it absolutely fascinating i love the different people who are really trying to get their business off the ground and i find it very exciting actually working with them helping them to really hone their skills and to really focus on what are the important aspects of a business and what you need to do in order to develop a business. Great, great. thank you. Thank you for your time and really giving us your perspective on our programme. And if yeah. anyone in the audience wants to find out more about the Forward Trust Enterprise programme, please visit our website.